Hi, I'm Dawn Mansky, founder of Made for Freedom. We partner with centers around the world that provide dignified employment for survivors of sex trafficking and marginalized women. The reason we do this is because women in vulnerable situations desperately need employment. So we look for centers that are providing not only that safe place of healing when women have been exploited, but life skills and job training and that important key component of dignified employment so that they can support themselves and stand on their own two feet and not be as vulnerable to exploitation. Failure helps build us and strengthen us. We deal with failure often as entrepreneurs. Entrepreneurship is, an, is a constant roller coaster and we, we experience incredible highs and incredible lows, sometimes within five minutes. And I think it just strengthens us and helps us, helps us persevere through the failures. And, and oftentimes it's said, fail quickly. Um, you, can't always, you can't always decide how quickly you fail if you're gonna fail, but it's that constant pushing and figuring out how much how much do you have to push and how much do you have to give and how much do you pour of yourself into it. It is going to take more time, more money, more of yourself than you can imagine. But it'll be an amazing experience. You may fail. In fact, chances are really good that you will fail. But it's worth the ride. Social entrepreneurship is I think it's an up-and-coming business model that needs to be given serious consideration. There are so many people that don't understand it. There are so many businesses that are built on exploiting others and not really looking out for the needs of those that they're working with and working for. But social entrepreneurship has that kind of DNA where you're looking at how do I make this world a better place? Not just for myself, but for everyone involved. It's a difficult, it's a difficult landscape because people get you confused. They, they don't know the not, people are very accustomed to the nonprofit, the traditional nonprofit and the traditional business. If you happen to be a for-profit social enterprise, people assume that when you say for-profit, you're making a load of money and that you're not worried about the people that you're working with. Um, if they hear that you're a nonprofit, they assume you shouldn't make any money at all. So you're just, it's just a strange space. But I think it's a valuable space that needs to grow and needs more recognition and more acknowledgement. Don Mansky, Made for Freedom, madeforfreedom.com.